Hello, my name is Adam Bean and today I would like to show you how to validate JSON objects in JAXRS. So, um, and Java 7 of course. So I would like to start, as always, with a simplistic Maven project and call it uh, JValidate, ah, JSON validate. it's nicer. And um, so, and then just start with a single resource validate boundary messages boundary and this resource only need the path so uh, I call it messages and the single method safe with a JSON object as a input and just go with post it doesn't really matter and this so and now i'd like to validate this input so what i can do simply i will create a validation constraint and call it uh, valid message and i would like to validate java x json object okay and this is uh, the uh, annotation and I would like to use just up to, to apply the annotation on the parameter. So the valid message validator. So what I would like to do here is to remember the annotation as a field. So we will use it later and now just implement a very simple validation like the value has to contain a string for the key message and the string should contain of course our duke so there is nothing is valid without the duke so and uh, then of course we can put here the valid message annotation and then try it so I will just run it and just choose Payara this time and um, so it's deployed I will just pick the URI and then try something here so I would like to initiate the post um, and I have to set the setter uh, the header content type application JSON and the payload which has to be sent is a message and uh, the content of the message is the duke and then i will just say resources messages and um, i will see the oh see the error so what's for oh just forgot so no content actually great news so as you can see input message duke and now try uh, something else, not message duke rather than uh, message nuke. And we get bad requests, so it seems to work. So now what we can also do, we could say, okay, the valid message annotation contains an expected string and the expected string can be now let's say expected nuke so we just change it and this is the reason why i remembered the annotation here because now we can say value get string message contains not duke but we can say whatever we set in the annotation so what it now means now not found so i will have to redeploy it now the nuke is valid and the duke shouldn't be valid. So just run it. And our duke is invalid and the nuke is valid. So the um, 
Duke produced 400 and the other one 204. So um, this is fairly easy in Java 7 to validate the input, so we could you know, make it even more generic to uh, validate JSON objects. And in Java 8 and bin validation 2.0 is probably is getting even better than this. So uh, thank you for watching. See you in upcoming uh, conferences, workshops, Munich Airport, yahex.com. Um, our projects and don't forget the first Monday of the month um, I will answer all your questions so um, un uh, gather the questions the whole month and answer me at the first Monday of the month so thank you for watching and bye